<laughs> you get me too close up. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. All right, what's up, guys? <laughs> get my face back. Okay. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Last week we did the windshield. Uh, today we're going to move forward with my interior. We're going to take this old dirty bench seat out, wash it. Um, I'm going to dye it a darker gray. We're going to throw my sun visors in, my steering column, and some new carpet. Let's get started. Let's find my door handle. <laughs> No, you got it. Yeah. I think I'm just spinning the washer. <laughs> I am. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had it. <laughs> <laughs> So this is some spray I found at Dollar Tree. It's a totally awesome spray. That's actually what it's called. I already used it on this spot here. It looks like it does a pretty good job. So I'm just gonna coat it in this stuff and then we're gonna power wash it. So first you want to go this way and then go through the opposite way. We'll go over the whole seat like that, try to work up some of this dirt. So my speedo meter stopped working a while back. Uh, I bought this speed sensor. Hopefully that'll fix that. <laughs> and no, I don't actually say speedo meter. It's speedometer. <laughs> All right, my dad says the speed sensor is right here, so I just got to pull that bolt off. This is actually really hard to get out and I accidentally broke the end of it off. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 
Oh, oh no, you did. no. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, there he goes. There he goes. Sweet. Kimmy. Victory. Oh, there's a leaf in there. Get out of there. All right, so here's the old speed sensor. It was kind of hard to get out of there because I broke this end piece off. So I barely had anything to grab onto. Here's the new piece. Let's go put that in there. <laughs> I'm just on. like, how does this go together though? Okay, so I have to take this gear off of here and put it onto the end of this one and then we'll put it on. Okay, so I have to get this gear off of the old speed sensor so I can put it on this one and it looks like it's held on by a little C-clip. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I went ahead and let my dad take that C-clip off. I was afraid if I tried to do it, I would fling it across the room, so. But it's off of there. All right, and then this guy goes on here. How does that go, like this? No? How did that go on there? We should take a picture. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so my dad went ahead and put the C-clip on too, but I'm gonna put the part in like a big girl. <laughs> I'm gonna get some oil, because it's always a good idea to oil your O-ring so that it'll slip in there easier. Slippery. A little bit. There you go, just like that. All right, so that wasn't too bad. Hopefully that fixed it. We'll take it out for a test drive here in a little bit and see. Uh, I like that you like held the truck. Like yeah, like I was gonna do like something. Like he's gonna do something, yeah. Hey. Use your body weight. Your body I don't weight. Have none. Stand up and push your weight down on it. There you go. Keep going. All right, that ought to be good. There you go. Now pull that out. All right, so I let the seat dry for a couple days. We're going to shoot it with this fabric dye. But before I can do that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, tape off any parts that I don't want dyed and replace my old headrests with these ones that I found at the salvage yard. From what I understand, this is like spray paint, but it's like a dye that's gonna soak into the fabric. I'm gonna hold it about eight to 10 inches away, do about two to three coats and let it dry for a little bit in between. See how it turns out. Okay, I think I'm good. All right, yeah, I'm gonna start in the back so I can kind of get a feel for it first.
from there. <laughs> I thought it was not looking where my nozzle was. That could have been my face. Yeah, mine too. Let me look again. Are you about to do it again? <laughs> I'm nervous now. I can't. Oh, I'm gonna laugh at you. Can you get them? Can you get that spot right there? There you go. Woo! Oh, what was that? <laughs> yeah, Down. you got to do it. <laughs> no. Uh oh, you're doing it. All right, start up here. Can you reach that high? She's vertically challenged. I think that looks awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and get <laughs> some of this you tape off. Or paint fill. Oh, yeah, I probably need to fix my bangs anyway. All right, I think that looks awesome. In my opinion, that turned out really good. I'm gonna go ahead and get some of this tape off. It's about the same color as the leather, huh? Pretty much. Here's my brand new carpet. I found it on Amazon for about 150 bucks. So that was pretty cool. It's not touching the floor, Dad. Where did I put it? <laughs> Blood is all over it already. It looks like you got a piece for the back, too. Is that what that is? Yeah, that's what it had you in the. You have to vacuum it. That's what it has in the in the picture. got my brand new carpet in. I've got my seat in. It's time to put in these custom sun visors. I see a lot of mini trucks with uh, different art on them. So, and I've always liked zombies. So that's what I went with. Good. Like it. Check it out. It's pretty cool. All right, guys. I think that finishes up my uh, interior upgrade video for about now. Uh, I've got a steering column I can throw in there for the next video. I've just got to dye it gray as well. I've got a door panel. Got a new armrest. All of that was picked up at the salvage yard. So that would be cool to replace later. I've got 50 shades of gray going on in there. <laughs> it looks pretty good, though. This thing actually smells brand new now, which is awesome, because this thing's like 25 years old. So this is really cool for only 25 bucks at AutoZone. It switches to like 20 different colors. 
eventually we'll have this rigged up better. We just did it quick for the purpose of the video and it's really late. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Looks good going on the new carpet. <laughs> so like I said before, I've got a few little finishing touches I've got to do uh, for later videos. But that was really fun. Turned out really good. So don't forget, guys, please go like, share, and subscribe. Check out my Instagram. I'll leave a link down below for that. It's very, very much appreciated. This channel took off pretty fast already, a thousand subscribers. That is awesome. I was not expecting that in one week. <laughs> that is, that's awesome. I'm looking forward to more videos. So stay tuned, guys. We'll keep the videos coming. I've got big plans for this truck. I'm looking forward to it.